Hey, this is Stepan with Claire Online Video, and welcome to this short tutorial on using the Time Tuner feature in Adobe Premiere Creative Cloud 2015. This new feature could come in handy for those of you who are editing programs and videos that need alternate durations or total record times for different destinations. Adobe now allows you to easily adjust the length of a video to fit a specific requirement by adding or removing frames at scene changes, audio passages, and during periods of low visual activity. In a nutshell, you can alter the duration of a video by increasing or decreasing it by 10%. This could be helpful when you're on a deadline or if you want to automate your process a bit. In this example, I'm going to take a 16 second clip that a client wanted to use for their Instagram channel and use the time tuner feature to deliver a 15 second video that meets that channel's time limit. I'm going to do all of this without having to adjust the duration of my video in the timeline. With our video already placed into a sequence, I'll navigate to File, Export, Media. With our export window open, I won't worry about anything else for this tutorial. I'll scroll down to the effects area and locate the time tuner area and enable the check mark next to it. Now we can fill in a value for the target duration, or you can adjust the duration change percentage value. You can then export your video, and you will have a 15 second clip where Premiere has removed some frames to fit your desired duration. This feature could really help in those situations where you need to crank out a video that needs to be a bit shorter or longer than your edit. Thanks for watching and be sure to check out my other tutorials here on Streaming Media Producer.